watching on YouTube, it's your girl Kwani, and I'm here with Rezo Vending. Our other co-owner is my daughter Kwale, and we are here inspiring mothers and daughters to pursue passive income through vending. If you are new to our channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to be sure that you're catching everything that we'll be releasing and dropping at all times, okay? We don't want you guys to miss anything. Today, we are out here in these vending streets setting up a new location. Yeah. That is a two head oak machine that we're gonna be placing in one of our current locations and swapping out the machine that's there to one of our new bulk candy locations. We're also doing a collection today at our first full line location. This will be our first collection. It's been about 15 days. So we wanna pop in and see how it did for the first two weeks ever in operation. So thank you guys for tuning in. Let's do this. stuck yeah it got stuck and then this tricked everybody what happened because the red is in the blue and the blue is in the red really but i didn't tell nobody i just watch everybody come out because i said hey man there's gatorade in the machine over there red one i'm like yeah so i'm thinking that they're gonna push this one and they come out with the blue one and they're like man and i just look at him and shake my head because i already knew because i was the first one to get out of here so i would just watch everybody come out with this disappointed look on their face and then just laugh at them you fucking knew i'm saying yeah I my bad. Okay, right, I'll fix it. It's an easy fix. I just swap these. This vending stuff is not as easy as it looks, guys. So I just heard from the supervisor here that people's coins have been getting stuck, their dollars have been getting stuck, and I actually put my red and blue Gatorade in the wrong spots. Let's fix all this.
our next two locations. And you know what? We're gonna go hand out some free snacks. I'm feeling, uh, I'm feeling happy today. I'm feeling uh, like giving some blessings for those that had stuff stuck, and for those who had money stuck, and for those that wanted the Gatorade and they was the wrong color. Anyway, we got snacks in the bag. See those snacks, see those snacks. Okay, if they catch me, I'm gonna go find them. Let's go hand out some snacks. Let's go ahead and count this up and see what our first collection was at our full line location. Let's see. Fifty-eight, and then we had two dollars and twenty-five cents in change that was stuck in the snack machine so that's a total of $60.25 that's in 15 days so I mean it's not amazing but hey it's my first full line location I'm not tripping it's better than those things being in my garage for seven months so it's all good so let's go ahead and get back to what we do best these bulk machines <laughs> is broken I can't believe my coin mech is broken guys I was intending to just shoot straight from this location out to our newest location but now I have to go home and get a new coin mech beautiful people we are headed to drop off this machine finally we had to do a pit stop at the house and get the extra parts to fix that broken coin mech. Now, the thing that I don't like about finding that, finding out that that coin mech was broken is that the location didn't even call me to tell me. Now, one or two things could have happened. One, they just didn't know, or two, they just didn't care. Either way, I'm just glad that I caught it, guys. Um, I actually did a collection about a week and a half ago, so it really hasn't been broken that long. There was also a dollar in there already, so which is excellent for that location. But you see how the universe works? You see God looking out for your girl? Timing, guys. Timing is everything. But also with timing comes effort, comes energy. Yo, what you put your energy into, what you put your effort into, it is going to resonate. It is going, you're gonna reap what you sow. You're gonna give back what you give. I truly believe that. So, hey, thank you God for looking out for your girl. I already, I already was gonna pull the machine anyway. Wow, guys, that was the most difficult candy machine I've ever placed in my life. So the staff there was trying to tell me that I couldn't place the machine that he doesn't have any space and that who did I talk to he was so adamant who did you talk to who did you talk to who did you talk to and I'm like yo I called like two weeks ago I don't remember and I really don't remember who I spoke to so tip for you all Razo supporters remember who you talked to he was really trying to push me out the door and send me back home with my candy machine and I wasn't having it now I wasn't able to record much of that because he was just, he, he was giving off some energy and vibes that was like, whoa, and I didn't want to put him even more on edge. We're persistent out here in these vending streets, all right? Don't take no for an answer. We don't take no. They close the door, crawl through the window, all right? That's gonna do it for today, guys. Thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you were inspired, if you were entertained, or if you learned something new, go ahead and hit that like button. Drop a comment down below. Tell a friend to tell a friend to follow Razo Vending right here on Instagram. Like us on Facebook and subscribe right here on YouTube. All right? Don't forget to subscribe.